All right, and welcome once again, guys. Welcome to FT Farms episode two. So we got two of our good buddies here uh, as well. We Mr. Coffee, Mr. Nick T. What's going on, guys? Yo, yo, yo. All right, well, it's good to see you guys, and thanks for coming and helping out here today. Uh, we got a few things. We're going to do some grass. So if you're catching up, if you didn't watch episode one and you really don't care to go watch episode one, let me fill you in and catch you up where we're at now. We got uh, basically oats planted, got them seeded. We got a couple of uh, horses. We got about four now in our uh, custom horse pad over on the main uh, animal area, which I'm actually going to go to, so we'll kind of get to see a little bit of that. We'll cut some grass. You know, Coffee and Nick both are going to do some wind rowing. Uh, we'll do some tethering, get everything ready. Uh, and then as soon as we can, uh, here in the next couple episodes, we'll be doing some bailing, get all that stuff up, get those bad boys fed. So if you guys are ready, hop into your uh, weapons of choice. I think Nick's in the 6R. Coffee's in the 7R. Uh, I'm in the 7R rear wheels. Got the doubles on those. So um, I, will, uh, I will follow you guys out, out of the main farm here. And as we're doing a little bit of driving here, I'm going to make sure and uh, pick up the weight uh, over here at the front. But anyway, as we're doing some driving, we are on our server here, part of an Trotto.net. So if you guys are interested in maybe trying to, you know, start to look at some stuff, I know most of the, all these guys can vouch for uh, the server being really good and really solid. So, um, yeah, it's uh, pretty typical. No, I'm just kidding. It's great. <laughs> well, I'd say it's not a typical server. It's actually pretty good. <clears throat> they've uh they finally got 19 we it kind of got off a rough start there but i feel like it's it's settled in quite nicely with it now indeed yes it has all right let's see y'all took off let's see all right so y'all went okay let me figure out which way i was gonna go here heading up to the shop yeah we're on the yellow brick road <laughs> Pick up a few new pieces of equipment. I'm gonna go this way. It's probably not supposed to go this way, but I'm gonna go anyway. Rebel. Ta -da. Oh yeah, this is my f yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so we were talking episode one and these nice little cut through roads here. This is one of those roads that cuts back up between the main farm and this, which is why we decided to put this in here. because uh, it leads you off to a perfect place right here to come right in uh, chicken coop here on the right cows there on the left got a couple of nice storage uh, nice storage facilities over here all right so i'll drop the uh let's see let's let's do this let's drop the weight off this side and we'll pick up the nova cats this way then it's back in to the weight yeah that's what we're doing That sounds incredible. It is. What's even more incredible is John Deere Nova Cat mowers. Yeah, I know. They're so beautiful. It's wonderful. amazing. Brings a tear to my eye. Are you sure that's not the cigar smoke coffee? Uh, or the bourbon. bourbon. <laughs> <laughs> Joysticks get a little haywire here. Oh, hey guys! Oh, driving a little crooked. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> there we go. All right, so I'm gonna go up uh, north of the BGA. So I'll go ahead and start uh, making my rounds there. Oh, we've actually also got this grass up here by the by the horse sh uh, sh the horse shed. I totally forgot about this place up here. Yep. Yeah, so you can see our custom horse area there. If you haven't seen that, is a new custom mod. Sweet. All right. Probably my favorite. Yep, I think so. Out of all the enclosures. Yep. Agreed. I've got another one, but it's basically like one of the other cow ones, and it's, I don't know, it's not as good, I don't think. All right, we'll unfold that, unfold that, so it should be good. And drop her down here, whoops, wrong button. Drop her down. All right. There we go. All right. Now 
How do you guys want me to merge this? Um, I, I don't know. I'm indifferent. However, you feel like gets it done the uh, you know, done the quickest. Um, I don't really get too close to stuff. I'll kind of stay off the the edges. So if you want to, you can just start merging it to the center. I don't know. So I think Coffee Jesus will pull the uh, the coon right coon merge max. Roger. Yep. Okay. And I've got the Coon GF eighty-seven twelve. Okay. Man, I love it, man. These things butter flat on the front. So flipping sweet. Yeah, and they're green and yellow. <laughs> Now, is that a personal custom edit? No. Okay. Maybe we get one more pass there. <clears throat> I don't know. Well, you, uh, you probably got enough... Uh, about to say you probably got enough width on that one to cover this on the second pass and yeah, we'll let you loop one more time yeah might make it easier on, might make it easier on coffee running around second time i'm letting it go around once now come in okay I mean, there. <clears throat> I mean shoot we might uh i actually really like that merch max that was one of my favorite stuff man when that came out as a dlc that was one of my favorite machines. I remember using it on old forms. Old streams? Yep, old stream. Yeah, his is about five meters wider than this tether. Yeah. Or point five, I mean. It's all about the points. <laughs> wow, that's a beautiful mower. It's... Yeah, we did, uh, I don't know, sometime here in the next, uh, next lap or something, or next couple laps, we'll, uh, I'll switch off here and we'll switch off here as we go through the food. I mean, go, <laughs> go through the food. <laughs> so we go through the field. <clears throat> Making the food. That's what, yeah, that's what I have in my mind. Making the food for the horses. Just a good thing we know what is actually straw and what's not. Yeah. You can get kind of confused. So we were talking here in the last uh, episode, or I guess I should say episode one. <clears throat> if you guys like, I'm trying to do a little more of uh, both, but uh, just let us know in the comments uh, if you like having a little bit more of that realistic in the cab, or if you like being outside and you know checking the scenery out, and <clears throat> not necessarily how you game and how you like to do it, but how you kind of like the video to run. I kind of have a tendency to get stuck in the cab. That's the only reason I asked that. It depends on what you're driving. Yep. Kind of like in American Truck Simulator, everyone's always like, oh my god, look at how cool my trailer is, and then they go under the in-cab view and you never see it again. <laughs> 
might as well just pull it just a, an untextured box back there. <laughs> Pretty much. Like, look at this wonderful truck. I'm like, hey, I want to see the trailer. <laughs> Pulling a hay bale with wheels. <laughs> Get him on the inside, folks. Oh. Would you like to drive the tether? Sure. Come back around here and complete lap two. Just turn the hazards off. <laughs> well, we were parked on the curb. <laughs> Didn't and like it. Squish. Yeah, I, I forgot my insurance card at home. This is one of those good maps because it, it doesn't have a bunch of fences and a bunch of... It's actually got some brush and some other little flowers and plants and stuff that break up the fields, you know. It's not the hard edge hedges every single place. Mm-hmm. Yep, it's nicely laid out, I agree. Yeah, I think, I mean, honestly, I mean, there, we, we had a couple of good maps there in 17, but I really think this has been one of the better ones of... Uh, the farm sim, you know, since I've been <clears throat> at least from 17 to 19, this is just a really good one. At least from the small medium maps, I there was a few that I, I kind of liked, but I didn't like them nearly as much as I did this one. Do we want to go over to 18 or between 14 and 20 now? Oh, uh, 18. Uh, it doesn't matter, it really doesn't. I'll be game to do whatever, whichever way you want to go. Both of them are about the same amount of space away. Yeah, maybe 18 is kind of cool. I'm going to get to show off the horse area down there. You'll ride by all that area down there. See what the horses are up to. Well, I got about a day and a half of food, so we got to get on it. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna rebel. Tip myself over over here. Supposed to be drinking after hours, Nick. Yeah, I know. If you want to, coffee, when you pull around this next one, um, try to leave that uh, that outside edger. Just try to leave it where it's at, so that way we'll actually be able to bail some of that. All right. It'll get a little difficult. I like that merge max is it's a little bit easier when you go up and down instead of racetracking it like what we're doing. I've never I've never quite figured out the easy way to do that merge max. Yeah, I was noticing that issue developed. I was like, I don't get these two. Yeah. 
Yeah, you could either switch. Uh, you could either. You, you might could switch the, uh, the the workload, and it would. Uh, that would probably fix it. Switch it to the other side, so it would throw what's on the inside of the out, and then just keep running that way, and it should it should put us up some stripes. You mean work mode? Yeah, work modes. Yeah, sorry. Uh, select the work. What is that? A Y key, maybe? Uh, I don't know. You have to, I think you have to lift it. Yeah, turn Build. it off. Yeah. Oh, all the way. Pretty sure you have to lift it for some reason to change the direction. So you went to 19. All right, so I'll let you finish up there. It's not giving me the option. Did you lift the thing up? Yeah, I lift it up and I even folded it up, tried it that way. It shows me select work mode and left. It doesn't have like a indicator what key it need to use. I think it's Y. Why is not working? Let me try. Um, try uh, turn it off. I just yeah, now try it. See if it'll let you select. You can jump in there and see if it'll work for you. Okay. Uh, let's see. So there you go. Yeah, so you had a... Okay, it wasn't all the way lifted. <clears throat> I'm not sure what the key. I've got half controller on here as well. So that's uh, to the right. Then you can actually do it in the middle if you want to do um, out of the middle. It would just okay. stack everything. That might be a little easier just doing that center part. Try that. Yeah. See if we get along there. I'll go ahead and I'll start tethering and... I'll switch with you when you come over at 18. And I should, that'll throw everything down to the middle now, so you should be, it feel, feel more like a regular one. Yep. Cute. The rats. Gonna need a lot of hay bales when we get all them cows going. Yeah, I know. That's a no. I'm still can. It's the funniest, funniest thing in the game is the birds. Yeah. You know, I, I actually put a, quite a bit of thought into. Um, I actually put quite a bit of thought of how I was gonna do the the the. the um, the horses and stuff down here so that I wouldn't have the birds jumping out of the sheds <laughs> <laughs> flying through the walls and stuff how so well I, when I went through the fields and stuff because the birds always land and jump out of the same the same spot just like a like a looping video so if you, oh. I would pick out the spots in the field because this is always the field right here. We grassed it and then, you know, I took through, went through the training tool and put laid out the mods and put all of these, uh, you know, textures and stuff together. But yeah, all that was a um, you know, good bit of thought in there just because I'd find out where the birds were and make sure that the birds weren't jumping out of any building that I put down. Because <laughs> you know me, I'm a little OCD when it comes to stuff like that. That's but, funny. But then interesting. So we can't have shotguns in the game. Get rid of those birds. <laughs> yeah, just turn them off. They're they're cool. I mean, they're cool. But yeah, when you added that really cool feature, being able to do the training and that kind of thing, you know, especially if you put a building somewhere, it's like they fly right up out of the building. <laughs> uh 
Instead of the hills have eyes, the barns have eyes. Yep. Well, this is just working out fantastic, isn't it? Yeah. Mower's just cruising right along. This is a lot... I don't know why this is a lot more fun to drive than the self-propelled. Oh, that big chrome. Yeah. Yeah. I find that, uh... Well, the good thing about that one is you can actually see. You know, especially if you want to do some in-cab stuff, you can see a lot easier when you're butterflying them in the front. Yeah. I find it a little bit challenging on the uh, self-propelled one just because it, you know, you really can't see nothing but the front. you got the wings over there, but there's no real grab. Yeah, that's the one good thing when it... Oh, uh, the guy that's doing the GPS, Wapser. That'll be nice when you get the GPS mod, because you'll be able to, you know, kind of get your bearings, you know, in the field before you go out there. Yeah. You don't have to do so yep. much looking behind you. You'll be able to, you know, somewhat automate, as well as, uh, I, the one thing I always liked about GPS was you could lift that line up right above the crop, and that way you could still use it as kind of a guide. I only ever used it to keep my line straight and then turn manually. Yeah. Yep. Any ETA on that one? No, not that I know of. I mean, he's shared some uh, screenshots on Facebook and. Um, he did another quick mod. Y'all remember the one that allows you to um, zoom in your field of view? Yeah. Like with the mouse and stuff, he's responsible for that one. Uh, player, the player view camera, or player camera, something like that. He does that one. Yeah, player camera. Mm -hmm. But if you are out there kind of wondering who he is, what he's got, he's got a Facebook page he's putting some updates on, so you can go follow him on that. Kind of keep up with the development of some of that stuff. I'm surprised at how many of these guys, you know, are still actively involved in Facebook and stuff. Yeah, that's where you find some of the best stuff. Yep. At least until someone leaks it. Yeah. Oh no, I hit the trailer. Well, I hope you're uh, got your insurance card on you there, Coffee. Hmm. Gonna have to take the bourbon away. That that's my tax. <laughs> I'm paid in alcohol and cigars. make the same track around. Now to switch out with coffee and run the... Yeah. Yeah, I'll... I'll uh, 
I'll run this one back down to the front corner here, Coffee. I'll, I'll switch with you. Hey, it sounds good. I'll be almost, almost, except for this one little strip here. on here cracks me up like Chris Potter cut loose it sounds kind of like put loose mm. oh, end game radio yeah there you go thank you sir yeah oh, zip over there there we go This thing is modeled so good. Yeah, it is. Fun to watch it. Mm -hmm. I think that was a pretty good DLC. Some people didn't like it because most of the stuff was super tiny. Yeah. They wanted the big old bud. Well, it, it, you know, it came out at a good time, though. I mean, there were some really good maps to use them on, you know, at first. Yeah, most most people demoed that on uh, right around the heyday time of old streams coming out from Black Sheep. Yep. I haven't heard anything from them. Are they making a new map? No, they're making uh, the Valley of Old Stream. They're making the, the revamp. They're pulling that map out for 19. So the valley and Old Stream, or just one? Well, the valley of Old Stream. So the valley was the the revamped one that they went back and redid. You know, they added to it. Mm -hmm. So that's the one that they're um, that's the one that they're going to pull out for their first uh, their first map for 19. little surprised that it's not nothing out yet yeah yeah I am too I know oxygen David was working on another one um, I think he was gonna pull out one that he'd already done they work on converting some of their stuff over Which, you know that's what it is I guess I figured they might want to take you know take advantage of some of the new stuff you know, from the maps or whatever that they'll be able to do, but yeah, so much has changed. It almost seems like it would be easier to start over. Yeah, I'll try to retrofit everything that you were doing. Textures. And... Mm -hmm. So it seems like a lot of the uh, tractor guys, the tractor mod guys, have been doing. And we got a mod for every recolor possible. <laughs> that the truth. Mm -hmm. Every course, weight known to man. <laughs> yeah, it's a, when when poor console players fire up on Fridays and they got like another. 5,000 liter trailer and a weight set. <laughs> I remember those days. Got more weights than the Lifetime Fitness over here. <laughs> oh, no, we'll be happy. It's time to pump you up. That was a great skit. <laughs> Saturday Night Live.
Bull Tail loved Saturday Night Live. Used to. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed the uh, I, I enjoyed the old school stuff, man. When they had the really the really funny comedians on there. Dana Carvey. Mm, yep. The church lady. I like Chevy Chase. I liked him on there. Steve Martin. Uh, Aykroyd, Dan Aykroyd. I like I liked all their stuff, man. Good stuff. Yep. You don't even have to be old or young or any middle aged to enjoy their stuff. It was good. And Sam would sing that skip with Lunch Lady with Chris Farr. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Putting a hurt on this field. Well, I think it's going to be it for us. We're going to go ahead and finish up the field here, guys. Appreciate you jumping in here, joining us here on uh, episode two. Hope you enjoyed a little bit of wavy, wavy lines here with uh, the grass. We'll work on uh, getting all our bales and uh, getting everything set and finally getting some things over. And we might even make it to finally getting some uh, some actual food there in the troughs with the horses. So uh, we'll do that. Then I guess we'll be on to the next animal, the next crop, and the next video. So anyway, thank you, Coffee. Thanks, Nick. Yep. You are welcome. Absolutely, man. Had a blast as always. You guys, be sure to like. Be sure to subscribe. Come join us here in the Discord. Come say hey. Come share some farm sim screenshots of your own. Uh, other than that, guys, we'll see you all here in the next video. We'll see you. Peace.